So last time I said this was potentially the final war for uh, High King Grum and then we went ahead and survived about four wars in last episode and now we find ourselves raising armies again for a new war. 74 years old we are now and we are still going fairly strong. However we are a known murderer. Vicious rumours, not the best. Oh, would you look at who we just captured, a chieftain. So we've managed to defeat them in battle. What we are going to do is get the remainder of our forces over here now. In fact, if you guys can go this way, that would be very nice. You can take care of the remnants of the army because we are at 10% on the current war score. Fantastic. Oh, we actually have enough men in both regions. So let's keep that there. Let's try and get to Bleakwind in that case. In fact, we'll send you guys there. Um, so one child that's a guardian is Lolia, who is my granddaughter. We'll educate her Marcia again, yes. That's very nice. So now we have enough men pretty much everywhere. So we're actually going to try and send you guys over to Reach Cliff. Oh, we forgot about you four. Four men to defend the realm. That's all it takes. Uh, and so the war is just going to be fairly straightforward this episode. Hopefully nothing's going to come to fruition because the factions aren't really strong enough. Oh, Elective has actually snuck up a little bit. And Gelly, uh, we're actually trying to improve opinion of him. Are you not doing your job? No, oh, you're still in, you're in Scarstone. Why are you in Scarstone? Is that where Gelly is? Hang on a minute. No, he's in White Room. I really thought I sent you over. Oh yes, we did. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Got confused then. Right, we're almost there now, people. We've taken the first piece of territory. We're going to get you there. What's happening? Over Vassal Limit, damn it. Uh, Betrothed can marry. We'll go ahead and do that. Uh, we would have to start signing some vassals. We're over by one now. But let us end this war first. Oh, years later, after the first turbulent years, it seems everyone in the country has gotten used to Marcia Ararano. Some appreciate her and some do not, but the more violent controversy and commotion has died out and people are now preoccupied with other matters. She lives on, although the tale of the early years of the hero of Northwatch are already stuff of legends. Brilliant. Very good indeed. The Skyhammer against us? Yes, they are indeed. Let's um, I'll send you guys there because that's actually still flashing against us. 641. War score is going very nicely. So what do you want? Baron of... So you actually have... Uh, and you want Raven Scar. Hmm, to give Raven Scar or not? Makes sense to be honest. Um, let's do that. Okay, there's nothing for us to take there. Nothing for us to take there. How are we actually going to win this? Is it just going to tick over this uh, Hagraven claim? Are they in one of these territories? Some more than likely. I'm not going to. Have a look too, too hard for them. In fact, let's get you guys. Yeah, that's fine. A group of unknown cultists have reared their ugly heads in the province of Northwatch. Oh god, we've lost favour because of that. 88% on the war score and Reachcliff is about to fall. Excellent. We are at 100% but I'm going to make sure that we've captured all of the pieces of the territory. Can't believe we were so close last time and weren't able to do it. One more, there we go, and everyone let's finish up in Carspire, that's actually quite uh, quite good, we finish up in the capital, 1700, brilliant, now they'll go ahead. Right, so there's one pl place left, and we're not going to be able to do anything with that because technically, we're now in the truce. For 10 years. 
Ooh. Now we would lose 4,000 prestige. Lo lower all Reach Faith's ruler's opinion of you by 25%. I don't think we can take that. But Skyrim is looking really good. Now, oh, what's happened here? That is full right for the picking. Oh, damn it, we can't do it. Oh yeah, well sorry, I'm on a claim. They want the claim, we want to unite Skyrim, so we'll do that. Uh, Rakund. What are you guys like? 1,500, so let's declare that. Whew, right. And can we take you as well? Right people, we're off and running. Let's go into it. So all of you on this side, I'm going to get you to meet up here in Igmaric. Oh my god, they've got far more than we thought. Um, scratch that. Let's get you all to meet up over here. I'm actually going to disband you guys. Um, we're going to try and take this really quickly. In fact, you know what? I'm going to send everyone there. Right, let's get ourselves some additional men. Mercenaries, uh, the 60 units will probably be the best for us. That's fine. Let's get you down there. And what I'm also going to do is maintain these ships as well. Right, we're off and running. 1,200 men. Where have they got 1,200 men from? That's what I want to know. Keep on walking guys, get out of there. So the 11 ships are there as well. Um, I'm going to have you guys meet here. I'm going to call up some more mercs. There we go. Uh, I'm going to try. Oh damn it, I don't have enough. How many mercs have we got there? <laughs> Slightly over my limit. Oh, we don't have any more ships. Are you kidding me? Okay, that's going to cost us quite a bit because we can't actually do anything. Right, we're going to have to send you over by land. Quite unfortunate. I mean, I could split the mercs in two, I suppose. Send a bigger group on the boats. Let's do that. So we've got 440. Oh my god, they've got 2,000 on the way. Um, let's pull out. Everyone to Ravenstead. We'll have enough men to take care of them, rest assured. Uh, looks like we've got like a thousand men now. We'll send you guys back. How soon till you're there? We've got another 200 or so. We'll get you guys marching on up. Get you there as well. You're in the territory now. Right, quickly. We need to get there. They're marching on no one. We've got our 4,000 men. Let's go in and take care of them, please. Brilliant. On board. There we go. Alright, we should have enough men now. We'll go in and we'll take care of what we've got here. Yeah, we're going to win this battle quite easily by the looks of things. Right, let's get here and we'll do our usual tactic of assaulting. We've got 1,700 men there. Denilus is going to command. Oh. Ah, okay. Let's get you someone else on the flank, shall we? I'm in solitude, so I'm in this army. We need to be careful here. Um, Hogney. Yeah, we'll do that, Hogney. Right, it looks like we're here. We don't really have enough men at the moment, but we do now. Now we've got 4,000 men. Oh my god, how many defenders have they got there? I'm going to wait a little bit so that goes down. On a lark, I decide to travel among the common folk incognito uh, with a servant and bodyguards. Oh my god. An arrow suddenly sprouts from the neck of my trusted companion. We were surrounded, no bandits, but agents of Artinio, the criminal. 
Oh my god. Martini, oh you bastard. My spy master. Oh, right, okay. Can we pay for our ransom? 250 gold, we don't have 250 gold. Right, can we get out? Let's cancel that ambition, see if we can get a new one, get out of prison. Yes, we can. Make an escape attempt. Oh, do we want to do it just yet? Let's see how we get on. Damn it, we're losing men here. Attrition is killing us. We're going to have to assault this. It's attrition, actually. 1,000. Oh, we're going to have to try and attempt this. I'm going to wait for this battle to end. We're going to have to try and escape. Let's take um, Volskag first. Damn it, I can't believe he's gone ahead and imprisoned us. Ah, uh, Marcia, you can take him. Swines! What can we do? Who's my spy master as well? We're not gonna. We can't make the money. Like, do we have anyone in prison? We can actually. Uh, we've got four. Castle and 70 gold. Aurelian, 70. Oh, these people I didn't want to let go. Bot here. It's folk hammer. Why can we not ransom you, Bot here? 70 gold. What have you got? You've got 63. Let's send you a gift of 20. And then we'll ransom you as well. Is that going to be enough? That should be enough. Okay. Now, now it's your turn. So public enemy number one is Governor Atenio the criminal. And the man himself, he's not gonna last long. We are going to be plotting to kill that bastard. Let's see how we get on with that. Right, we're very close there. Um, we fulfilled our ambition, which is fine. Uh, we need to choose a focus. I'm gonna go back to a water rulership for now. Reign for 10 years would be nice. Yes, I know we're over the vassal limit. We really need to have a look at this because it's only going to add fuel to the fire of, uh, of other things. Right, we've taken these. We haven't been able to do much else though. Right, we're going to head over to this particular region, I think, now. South, we'll try and take that. Over here, we're not doing too bad. 440. We can go ahead and assault, which I think we do that. 50 gold? No. The mayor can do it. I've gained the trait Ambitious. My co-conspirator, Lord Mayor Takio, has assembled a party of mercenaries who ambush Governor Martinio disguised as highwaymen. Do it. Well, he's known as... Oh, that's... He's known as the Shadow. That's fine. Do it. Let's try it. Right, so we've gone ahead and we've won this particular war. Excellent. Still really can't do anything against these guys though, can we? We'll send them all over and we'll see. Success. Artinio, the driver. They let the driver go and he convinced the attack was carried out by highwaymen. Brilliant. So no one knows and we've taken care of that. We've gained vengeance on that. Fantastic. Right, let's move on in. So they've got over a thousand defenders again. My bodyguard has retired to a small farm in the country. Bloody hell, I am that old that my bodyguard's even retired. Whew. Right, anything else we can be doing? Well, we'll disband here. Uh, I really need these guys down this way. 
All right, you've created the title. I'm fine with that, to be honest with you. That's not much of a problem. Oh, let's go ahead. They've done us a favor there. Um, I'll actually disband you two. I don't need you. We'll take care of this army because this war score is just going to tick on over. That should put us to 100%. What? 172 gold. And we get diligent. No, I can't afford that. Tax income is going to have to drop. Oh, it looks like they've called people. So we've got feuding going on. Um, Arnold is going to be right. Because the other guy hates me anyway. Stewardship plus one. Brilliant. Ninety-seven. My word. Right, let's push on down here. In fact, you know what? Let's split into two. I'm going to send you guys to actually just take care of this small army. I'll toss him into the dungeons. Oh, I've actually gained a trait just. Let's get you over here as well. Right, I think that's pretty much all we can do for the time being. We need to get ourselves a new Chancellor. Are they all dying or something? Gorgic of Skyborn. A new Steward. Um, Steward would be Manilus, would be my son. Who himself is actually getting a little bit. And Tyrannus, my other son. Yeah, we'll put my sons in power. The undead are rising from their tombs in Carspire. Well, since I don't run Carspire, it's not that much to me, is it? What the hell happened here? False guards? Did we just lose that because they've lost the territory? Terrible, right? We're gonna have to go here. Not what we wanted to happen, people. Eurosec looks like it survived another day. Yes, we know this. We'll threaten him. He can stay out of plots. He's sworn to stay out of all factions. That's good because he normally stirs up things. Independence is becoming a bit of an issue for us yet again. It looks like this war is finally ticking over, very very slowly, 66%, and we're now in the capital of Sinia. I think we'll be able to end this quite fast. What a shame, Eurosec must have had a change of Yarls or something. I'm not bothered going to look through all that to see exactly what happens, but that's what we'll just assume for now. Obviously, you can tell me. Alright, that's fair enough. Yes, we've just lost some people. Because we're bankrupt, so let's take care of this army then, shall we? Parties of adventurers have arrived again. Damn it. Good news is, uh, Batalft is fallen. Um, so all we can do is just carry on into this bloody territory. Okay. Let's get on down, people. 77 years old, I assume I'm in this army as well. Makes things a little bit difficult. Um, so, pretty much, Uston Hall, that's actually fallen under Camlon, who are our, uh, our friends. The Clothing Estates hold the most amount of land, which we need to claim back. But really, this war is just to take hold of uh, that piece of land there. Um, so it looks like we're getting fairly close. We are actually just trying to take out what little people we actually can manage. No one's decided to join them and help them, which is fine by me. We'll go down and just take care of this. No, I'm just going to keep that information to myself. Manilus will be, be honourable to me. Ah, I've lost the trait just. Let's get back over to their capital, shall we? Because if we get there first, hopefully we can be leading a siege against them. Ah, oh, damn it, we've not got there first. We'll get here. What are they actually at a war for? Conquest of Aldos, it looks like. Okay, well, let's see if we can uh, speed things up a little bit for ourselves. Gallus has finally returned home after a long and successful career in 
something. Whatever thing he was doing while he was away, he learned much and experienced warriors and knights favoured by both Nords and Osimo warriors. Journeyman Assassin, a guild membership, shadowy past. Tell me about what you were doing, son. Hmm. Interesting. Um, so we are pretty much going to go down and probably just assault this. There you go, 68%. Oh, we need them to get the hell out of there. So 727 left. Wasker at 71%. That feels like it's all we've been doing recently. We're going to go ahead and assault. And we've taken that. We're at 85% now. Um, can we actually take any more land? Yeah, there's a couple of pieces of territory they haven't been able to take. So we'll just try and take it and push our score up a little bit. Ah, damn it, we don't have enough people. Anyone close by? Yes, thankfully, there is. Uh, everyone else, I think, we'll just go ahead and disband. We'll let you guys all uh, continue as normal, I think. Whew. Who would have thought we would have reached the good old age of 78? Numerous reports of feral lycanthropes have been made in Sarfo. We must aid the local populace, unfortunately, we really can't afford it. So, Hiking Grom, looks like he's going to live forever at this rate. Um, we'll try and finish this off in the next episode, but uh, hopefully you're enjoying the series. I'm as surprised as anyone that he's still alive and he's still fighting. So uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.